what a spectacular way to end the weekend as we saw lots of sunshine and mild temperatures here as we went through this final weekend of January. However, the final days of the month are going to feature a bit of a roller coaster rise. We look towards the start of February. Right now, our max track live Doppler is all quiet. However, we are awaiting yet another cold front to track its way through. The rain that was around yesterday afternoon and evening has finally now moved on to the eastern seaboard. And this front is starting to fizzle as it's starting to sink its way further to the south and east, but much colder air is bottled up on the other side. And we even could be seeing a few snow showers and flurries flying tomorrow. But at least for the time being, we're just tracking increasing clouds into your Monday morning. So bundle up and also then just be prepared for cloudy skies. So really no weather worries as you're hitting the roads tomorrow morning. Skies will stay cloudy through about lunchtime. Then as we enter the early stages of the afternoon, there may be a brief window where we see a little bit of a rain snow mix before the cold air takes over. And then we start to track to scatter flurries and light snow in time for the evening commute. This is not going to be widespread activity. However, as the snow starts to fall, some slick spots also reduce visibility could be possible. But quickly, these snow showers begin to taper off Monday night into Tuesday morning, though still some lingering snow could be flying across our southeastern Kentucky counties. But then quickly, high pressure takes back over. We will be seeing sunshine returning on Tuesday. In terms of accumulation, this is going to be primarily Monday night, less than half an inch for the majority of us. Meanwhile, into southeastern Kentucky, where the snow lingers a little bit longer into Tuesday, also given your elevation. You could be seeing one to two inches of snow, but for the most part, this is not going to be a big event, at least to start the week. But a big event will be across our skies into Wednesday morning. This is a lunar trifecta, the super blue blood moon, as not only are we going to see a super moon, also a blue moon, the second full moon of the month, but also a lunar eclipse is going to occur. And this is the first time that a lunar eclipse has coincided with a blue moon in 150 years. Now, unfortunately, this moon is going to be setting just as that eclipse happens here in Kentucky, but certainly get a good view early Wednesday morning. Now temperatures a little bit of a seesaw over the next couple of days it was the 50s this weekend. We're down into the 30s Monday and Tuesday. We're back near 50 on Wednesday, but then the early stages of February are going to remind us that winter is far from over. We're tracking another wintry system that has caused a lot of chatter on social media over the past couple of days. This is just one computer model showing rain first moving in on Thursday, then the colder air takes over. There could be a period of a rain snow mix before we transition over to all snow. Too early to put any timing on that transition and also any numbers on a potential accumulation. But we will continue to track it over the coming days. So tonight we're just chilly and becoming mostly cloudy with lows in the upper 20s. Tomorrow the snow holds off until at least the late day uh, hours. However, still the evening commute could be slick in spots. We are cold into Tuesday as the sunshine returns. Then we soar close to 50 degrees on Wednesday. Then that winter system tracks in for the early days of February that will usher back in the real winter feel even into next weekend. We'll have more LEX 18 news after this.